Hey, what's up everybody? This is the Spy Patriot. Welcome back to another episode of Days Gone. On today's episode, we are going to be going hey, down to... Get your ass back to work. Oh, chill, on. bro. We're going to be going down to... Let's bring up the map. Down to Copeland's Camp. Well, it's just around the corner from Copeland's Camp, I think. And they really want us to learn how to track a deer. So... We're going to be heading down there. We'll grab our bike. I think it's down yeah. over here. And we'll head out towards that end of things. Let me get the gate for you. Hey. How's it going? Hey, Boozer, you there? I just caught a break. That hero over here might actually be useful. I know where they're going tomorrow. Wait, I thought you said you couldn't take them on. No, I can't. But with a little luck, I can get to their chopper without being seen and... Give them hell, brother. Remember what Jack used to say? Don't ride faster than your guardian angel can fly. Like I said, Jack used to say a lot of stupid shit. Pick it up. Okay, let's the way through here. Okay, let's see what goes on here. So, you want to learn how to hunt? Is that what I'm hearing? I know how to shoot a gun. It's a rifle, not a gun. I was in the 10th Mountain Cope. Don't give me any Marine Corps bullshit. Killing a buck's a little different than killing a man. Or a freak. The best way to hunt an animal is to track it. You gotta focus. And see what nature's trying to tell you. If you look hard enough, you'll see the signs. And of course, this is a forgotten um, uh, ability, a skill, is to go out and hunt. We've been so uh, put back in our own lives in city metropolises and whatnot that you kind of forget the arts of, of craft. So let's go ahead and find out where this deer is. Well, okay then. Look hard. See this pile of deer scat? It's fresh. Yeah, I see it. They lead this way. Yeah, I can see that. Well, come on, man. I see it down the hill there. Quick, there's your buck. I see him. Now here, use my rifle. If you were in the 10th mountain, you know how to use a scope. Yeah, Cope, I know how to use a scope. Easy, easy. I got this. Got him! I got no nice. shot. Damn it, it wasn't a kill shot. He got away. No, no, that's okay. You wounded him. He'll bleed out soon enough. We just gotta track him. Okay. See the blood spots? Look close. Yeah, I see him. And follow him. On it. He'll be slowing down about now. Losing too much blood. <clears throat> we should be coming across his carcass any time now. I bet freaking zombies are gonna get it. Okay, you know how to gut an animal? Oops. 
So I think I... Do we pass it? Oh, it's in the bush here. Yeah, look. Cope, Boozer and I have been hunting before. He used to go elk hunting with his old man, and yeah, he, uh, he showed me how to gut a deer. Well, let's just say no disrespect to Boozer, but you got a lot to learn. You're wasting a lot of meat there. Overall, not bad for a beginner. Yeah, thanks. Now, I'll take back that rifle. Here, thanks. Like I said, Deke, we can always use more venison at the camp. Still got some folks trying to heal up from that Ripper attack. Okay, Cope. Yeah, I'll see if I can remember that. Okay, that was just a basic little tutorial on how to track. Hey, um, man, I'm still not happy with you. I used to be a cop. Let's see what the mechanic. Yeah, uh, we'll keep the mechanic for a bit later. We don't really don't have any money anyway. So let's move on to the next mission, which looks to be already selected. So let's go to the map, and we'll see where they have us going. Okay, it's uh, making contact. Apparently, we've tracked down Nero Agent O'Brien. So let's head out in that direction and confront this guy. How's it going, booze man? Okay, uh, I guess it's been a while since we did any hunting. I'll see if I can scare up some meat while I'm out. Uh, what you're doing. Uh, yeah, I had both uh, give me a few pointers. Believe it or not. Oh, shit, don't believe it. Thanks, Dean. See you, Booth Map. Alright, now I just gotta find some meat. Okay, so let's head on and try to get in contact with this O'Brien guy. Do I take my bike down or what? Let's leave the bike here. I gotta get to O'Brien. I don't know if they're gonna shoot me or what if they see me.
so we'll just act like they will at this point. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Let's head back up the hill. this guy You might have become one yourself, and whether that been something. Uh-uh. Uh, what do you want? Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that uh, if conducting operations in quarantine zones, that if I encounter any civilians or sub sub civilians, that I'm forbidden from making contact. This guy is a, a, an really? army sergeant. See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next uh, time, uh, Nero camp, Protocol 2 7 states. I, Everyone was dead. Two they were slaughtered. Seven. Torn limb Nero for goddamn limb. Protocol All right, listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. I crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So, what's it going to be, O'Brien? <laughs> Yes. Okay. Okay. You remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember a, a knife wound. She she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead. So I'm going to ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Like you said, the uh, camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a uh, camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. Quick answer, yes. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but... I'll check. Uh huh. And I'm gonna go with you. No, you, you can't. Please, you don't. Hey, don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look. If you're gonna fucking kill me, do it. Okay? I did my job. Did the woman, your wife? I put her on oxygen. I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic. She wasn't gonna make it. But I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life. O'Brien, <sighs> report. I have to go. Please. You have to get out of here. You don't know these men. 
I don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you, I don't care how long it takes, I'm gonna track you down. And I'm gonna do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. Not to mention, I don't even think it was his wife. As soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deacon. Okay. Okay, so we have a good opportunity to get one of these bucks. So we're gonna go ahead and try. Are you out there, O'Brien? Oh, you son of a bitch! You better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I know you're on this channel. God damn. Get back to me, or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Oh, God damn it! Oh, come on, Brian. Back to me. Man, the guy just let you go like two seconds ago. This gear is pulling away from me. There's actually Thank one closer. Did you track down the chopper? Was it the same guy, the one we saw on the roof that night? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened to her. You like, don't think she's still alive. What? No. I mean, no, look, I'm not stupid, Boozer. I just want to find out, you know, what happened to her. Before she died. Got him. Hey, maybe you can finally, I don't know, find some peace. I don't need to find any peace. Jesus, Christ. I I gotta go. All right, Deacon out. Okay, now just gonna carve it up. Okay, we're finally making it to the area where... Okay, well, there's two of them here. Nice headshot. Ooh! That's how you do it. Back to the bike. How to get out of here? Probably easier just going back, like the way I came.
I would have liked to hit a couple of extra. Uh, bucks to sell but at this point I think at night time you get more activity with these zombies five four three two one run 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 best thing I can do at this point is jump in the back of that truck I think This is going to be uh, trouble. No! Run! Get the heck out of here! I didn't help. Oh my god. My bike looks like it's broken as well. I hear a bike. Run, run, run. <gasps> I think they ran after that biker. I believe my bike. Raider patrol, damn it. Go, go, More go. Bounties. <gasps> I can fix this. Done. Who was that? Oh, oh you bugger! Just get the hell out of here. Whoa! Oh, we were really close to the place, too. Home sweet home. Man, I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Looks like he's hey, sick. Dick, thanks, man. I'm not real hungry right now. I'll, I'll salt it up in a bit. Boss man looks uh, like he's dying. I guess you can get an infection for having burns like that. Anyway, that will bring us to the end of this episode of Days Gone. Thanks a lot for coming to join me, and we'll see you next time. Bye!